the navel for now. Ha! I knew there had to be a button somewhere. There had to be. It only made sense. Yo, DMO David, what up? Looks like we're live. Mark all this as red. Gee, nasty, what up? Sip's here too, what up, Sip? What up, friends? Mm, 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 mm. Tua, yo, yo. To you as well. Yo and yo. People settle in for class. Hey to you as well, Telvin. Hey, hey, golly. Do we have... I'm sure we do. Where's my list of things? Of things we gotta do today. Spider guard. What up, spider? We're gonna mark that as red. And then... We'll go here. Bam Bam Fam, what's up? What's up? What's up? And we'll get the feud stuff going. What up, big love? How you doing? All right, we'll mess around with that tonight. That sounds good. Wet knife, how you doing? Hello, hello. Get the people in the stream. Do the stream things. Mm -mm. B10, how you doing? Autofill. Autofill won't work. Of course it won't. <laughs> Big Fritz, how you doing? Jembo Jenkins, what's up? Wilfredo Flores, hey to you as well. How you doing? I mean... Hmm. Marco, what's up, Rosa? <laughs> Sue Pedri's here, Zandal's here, Wolverine, what's up, what's up? I mean, is this the best lineup that the six-star gold can muster? <laughs> Sandal, like, we started three minutes ago. What do you mean, what did I miss? <laughs> we literally just opened the door, man. Come on. Literally just opened the door. <laughs> Say word. What's up, Scott? Uh, I have no previews to do tonight, Bam Bam Fam. I got nothing I can do tonight on that on that front. What up, Fish? How you doing? So, nothing to share there. What I do have... Um, so, what, <laughs> what am I, you know, just finishing off the last of the peanut butter sandwich. So, it is what it is. Um, sort of madness I'm taking build requests. Like, sort of. It has to do with feud. So as long as it's a feud request, then maybe. <laughs> kind of, maybe. Um, no, no, Banana. Honey. And today I was feeling a little bit nice. And so I put in some raisins. It was actually really good. Yeah, nothing, nothing so much today, Bam Bam fam. Same with Jelly. So got the daughter's birthday cake left. Oh, nice. A sociopath. <laughs> I was feeling saucy today, Jay Nancy. What's up, Zesto? How you doing? CM Punk, how you doing? You know, the usual. Mook out. I just hit autofill, and this is what it gave me. So I was like, okay, I guess this is what. The gameplay, I guess, we'll do tonight. I don't know. <laughs> Rules, how you doing? Well, I guess I'm... These dang raisins out my teeth. 
Damn you, raisins. <laughs> the points. <laughs> You would expect that from Davey, but not from me. I mean, I'd share for everybody, but it sounds like anybody who eats the same way that I'm doing right now, according to Jay Nasty, makes me a sociopath. It needs, we need any Chelsea. I, I did ask today about that because I do have a few lineup brog for everybody. What's up, Recognize? This is the Bargain Basement. Ready for class. Chef Borakua is here today. Hello, hello. Uh, I got flash feuds. <laughs> <laughs> the Abigail. I hope so, Kurgan. It was more about the raisins in general. Yeah, it wasn't all the other parts. It was just the raisins on the sandwich that set you off. No, I, I make <clears throat> I make it for my <clears throat> my daughters all the time, right? I show them uh, the banana makes the smile. Then you put um, raisins for the eyes and the nose and stuff. That's the stuff. Six star shredder, six star raft from the tournament. Nice, Estelle Power. Congratulations. An autofill feud, right footers, right? Put an autofill and just see how see how well you can do on the autofill feud lineup. <laughs> so, what up, average giveaway winner? Can't wait to run both Chelsea greens in this feud. Don't blame you. She will be fun to use, you know, 99 MP and such. But we got other things to do. Uh, we're like seven minutes in. Anybody who's here is here. And if not, then they ain't here. Uh, what are we looking for? I'm looking for a brog button. You're 2,000 short of Seth. That's a lot short, Seth. So that's too bad. I'm so sorry to hear that. Seth would be a good one to get. What up, Brian Boone? Evening to you as well. The brog. Dun, 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 dun. The beef's here. What's up? <laughs> that's all you got was a six star gold all right y'all uh, as per usual I, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna record this it's actually really simple there's really nothing to say within your hate that sounds like the dishwasher <laughs> hype to play stalker too nice it looks like a lineup from 2020 it, it does right brother Ray this was the autofill lineup I, I thought it was an interesting lineup of things to put in there like we don't know, right, Telvin? But that's, you know, nothing that I can, nothing we can do about that tonight. I have no information and nothing to give and nothing to pass along and nothing to preview. So it is what it is. All right, let's do this. Class is in session and the professor is in. What's happening, y'all? We got a brog. It is the Flash Feuds info. It is a work in progress so as per usual until it goes live this is what we know so far this is as of the 22nd when or so this is going for the feud that is this weekend the 22nd feud number one is in game right now you see the lineup in game as it appears right now and that's going to begin on the 22nd at 6 p.m specifically pacific time it'll end on the 23rd at 2 a.m specifically pacific time uh to be determined and open in the top row the usual plus three starting all mp 100 percent gem damage 50 percent war score in the middle row you got chelsea green any striker and open and then on the bottom you have any raw any powerhouse, any technician, any open. This is all in game right now. None of this is anything new for anybody who's opened their game in the last 24 hours. What is new is what the other ones are going to be. And of course, because this is a flash feuds, it is 65,000 points. We know that per first time wins. If you know, you know. So feud number two is going to begin at 8 a.m. specifically Pacific time on the 23rd. And it's going to end at noon specifically Pacific time. And it is going to be a all a second female uh, feud in a row. Top row has any Alexa Bliss. Any Alexa Bliss in the top row is going to get you plus three starting MP, 100% gem damage, and 50% war score. So top row is open basically to everybody enjoy using your any alexa bliss uh in the middle row you got sherry martell sensational sherry at six star any trickster and open and that's going to come with plus one starting all mp 50 black move damage and 20 percent war score 
And the bottom row is going to be any Smackdown at 6 star, any Acro, any Trickster, an Open, plus 1 starting green MP, 25% blue gem damage, and 10% war score boost. All right. Feud number three. Feud number three is going to begin on the 23rd at 6 p.m. specifically Pacific time and end at midnight specifically Pacific time on the 24th. The top line for this one. So if you got yourself Mercy the Buzzard uh, and Open, that's going to be your top line bonus. Plus three starting MP, 100% all gem damage, 50% war score. Eric Rowan, the Rambling Rabbit at six star is going to be your middle line. Any Acrobat six star and Open. And that's going to come with a plus one starting all MP, 50% black move damage and 20% war score. And on the bottom row is going to be any Final Testament at six star. Any Powerhouse, any Showboat and Open, plus one starting green MP, plus 25% red gem damage, and plus 10% war score. So that is going to be number three. Feud number four, the one that's going to happen on Sunday at 6 a.m. specifically Pacific time and end at reset on Sunday at noon hour as it normally does. The top line's gonna be the muscle man. Pull up your pants and do the muscle man dance. And open. Middle is gonna have big pop up pump, Scott Steiner, any striker, and open. That's gonna come with plus one starting all MP, 50% red move damage, and 20% war score. And any new gen, six star on the bottom lane, any technician, any trickster. And open, plus one starting green MP, 25% green gem damage, 10% boost. You know how it is. Big Papa Pump's got your hookup. Holler if you hear me. Like if you like the post, which is what I just did. And apparently others have liked this as well too before me. But that is your flash view for the weekend. Let me know in the comments who you thinking about using. Thanks for coming to class. Good luck with the feud this weekend. Professor out. There we go. Holler if you hear me. Okay, uh, screenshots. Does anybody need screenshots of this? Can't fill any line with the third feud. Boo. Make it tech Scott. Why? Why, why would that make it any better? So that's one. Uh, for those just coming in, here's number two. Feudo Tudo. There we go. That fits on the screen. Tiger King, how you doing? No tops or middles. Telvin, I'm sorry to hear that. You don't have big pop-up pump? Uh B10, you just got you just got Scott on the on the pull. Nice. Alright, so there's number two. Any Alexa Bliss. What do y'all think of that? I asked to be sure. I was like, is this supposed to be any Alexa Bliss and not like pay or plane or just and they were like, no. <laughs> the foodie tootie. <laughs> that's funny. So that's number two. Feud number three. You'd rather have any Chelsea? I think a lot of people would rather have any Chelsea as well, too, but looks like it's not the case. <clears throat> What's happening in Restate? You have the Pyro Bliss and haven't, haven't touched or made her any better. Well, this is your chance to do so, I guess. There you go. All right, that's feud number three. And we're just doing a, a, a flash feud brog Restate. That's all we're doing. Here's feud number four. So y'all can take your pictures. Got both Chelsea's and all the Blisses. There you go. You got all the Alexis. <laughs> Who are you going to choose, Xerxes? I feel like a two mule, and that's why I asked. I asked specifically, is this supposed to be any Alexa Bliss? And the answer was yes. So, again, as always, this is a work in progress, and it's subject to change, but that I asked specifically when I saw that. Pyro with a pyro. <laughs> That's it. What's up, Bills Mafia? How you doing? All right. Anything else within here? Leave that. There we go. Anything else? Do we need to see anything else? Yeah, if you got the pyro princess, that would probably be easier one to use. No idea, eBooker. No announcement has been made. If they change it before the feud, there will be a riot. I asked. I said it on stream. I've done everything I possibly can. If they change it, then they change it. But I'm the nerf fesser, not the um, change the feud lineup fesser. 
So, uh, Infinity War, if it's anyone other than <laughs> Miss Sister Abigail, we all riot, I guess. Little Miss Bliss or Player Pain. Okay, well, one, one of those two will do free targeting. <laughs> Gonna start a riot. Gonna start a fight. Torches won't come my way. They say that every time. They say that every time. All right, anything else you all want to see here? Are we good? Are we good? So. <laughs> we have improv jokes to work on. I mean, I've never wanted to be an improvisationist. On pa yeah, on paper, it's who it's supposed to be, for sure. All right, looks like we're good here, so. Bye-bye. And to the stream we go. There's no need to keep that open. Ta-da! With my other 11 jobs, I got basically one job. <laughs> this is my hobby. Nice, Muka. Yeah, who else would it actually be this weekend, right? Unless they throw the massive curveball and throw someone in here that we're not even expecting. A new female superstar. It is, the, it is their month, for sure. Auto fail. What do you got for me this time? Does it come up with something different? Uh, Scon, I'm having. Oh, see, that's a much different <laughs> autofill than the last autofill. What if we put again? See if we get a new autofill. It could be April O'Neil. Wouldn't that be amazing, Jay Nasty? <laughs> nope, there it is. It stays the same. Womp womp. Nikki, Nikki or Alexa. Nia Jax for Black Friday. Final Testament is feuding. It could, yeah, it could be Scarlet this weekend. Wouldn't that be fun? Wouldn't that be crazy? All right, let's leave this for a second. Okay. Let's get back. Bad light. Yeah, a strange lineup to... All right, we're going to try it for a third time and see what comes up. When it's forced to make a decision. The algorithm is somehow working. I did click it, right? Yes. Okay, here we go. Okay, it, it corrected itself. Yes, Mule. Okay, so that reminds me that if um, if y'all are going to go onto the web shop and pick up the 130% belts, um, make sure you get it on the day that you want it. I think right now for the next few hours it is... Uh, it is showboats, right? So it is, you pick the classes set, it's just the era that could be different, right? So it's just random eras. Yeah, just randomly throw in a lineup that you can work with. Yeah, 130% belts uh, in the web store online. <laughs> Entire Nia Jack months. Cl Clayton wants to bankrupt this company. <laughs> We should have, here she had enough web going, yeah. No, Mr. DY, there's there's no stream on my channel tonight. I'm going to try to stream tomorrow. So we'll see if we can do a, a tomorrow stream with some giveaways, if not Friday afternoon at, uh, at 12 noon Eastern and specific time. I will do that. So Friday for sure. Um, and then we'll do the other ones afterwards. Uh, there was Festival, but it was just the feud lineups. Uh, I'll go over that again later. Uh, we have, if we set this up, uh, we're going to do some gameplay tonight. So the gameplay is related to one of two things that you can choose. The first um, is CSS for the weekend. So if you want to see gameplay of the CSS for the Flash Feuds, and as a reminder, that includes Chelsea Green, Roxanne, Shayna Baszler, Submission Magician, Pyro Princess, Sensational Sherry, Nikita Lyons, Dexter Loomis, The Boozard, The Great Muda, Eric Rowan, Ramblin' Rabbit, Joe Gacy, Bray Wyatt, Muscle Man, uh, Scott Steiner, Big Papa Pump, Drew McIntyre, Master of the Claymore. That's what we got. Everyone's got a price, that's true. <laughs> That'll teach me to switch with the <laughs> That'll teach you, sir. I mean, I had a nice date with night with my wife, so she asked if we can go out on Monday, and I said yes. So I'm not going to say no to that. Did I get buzzered? No, I have not gotten buzzered yet. I have not. 
So those are the CSS. And then the other thing that we can do if CSS is not in y'all's wheelhouse for tonight of things to play around with, um, then we are going to... Oh, God, who has this dang strap on? There we go. The other thing we can do... Oh, had a had a great time to be. It was it was a very nice night. We went out actually to Epcot. We drove to the Disney's because it takes forever to drive to Disney in this world. Um, so we had a nice night. With the bottom of footers, get out of here. <laughs> footers, get out of here. Or we can do some of this gameplay with these plates if if that is also up your alley tonight. Uh, we have. Uh, the insatiable hunger plate if you want to do some of that if you want to try this row break plate on anybody else what was the other plate that came out yesterday as well to that plate whenever we break seven row break gems generate 22 black so <laughs> the, those are those are our options tonight so what do y'all want to see what kind of gameplay do you want to see? Do you want to see the new plates? Do you want to pick CSS? Do we do this? What are we doing? A Leo Seth? I mean, that plate on Hall of Fame Rick Rude for fun? Oh my gosh. <laughs> you want to use it on Rick Rude? Yikes. Neville, get out of here, Moo Cow. Get out of here with that Moo Cow. Uh, Leo, like that? Bonus modify. I don't think anyone's actually played him since they did that stuff. Uh, da, 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 two seven by one. She's one by seven and a seven by one. That's the move. I think that's the gameplay. Someone made a video of this. It's a one MP charge. New plates. You got him with no clue how to run them. Okay. If 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 time allows, then we can do that. Jesse J, how you doing? Uh, Rick Rude. Oh my gosh. Rick Rude gameplay it is. That seems to be the crazy winner of this one. So, for once, as a uh, question, uh, yes, Clado, it is. Um, they had Christmas trees and things out there already. So, it's probably waiting until somebody else, yeah. Uh, as far as I know, Jesse J, yes, but I don't know, <laughs> right? That's, that's the, 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 that's the risk you take, Jesse J, is that if you don't get them now, you might never get them again. And hopefully before any sort of, uh, uh any sort of, uh, licensing runs out, they'll be available again. It, Titus was out of nowhere and that was, so... Um, I told everybody that if we had reached 80 subscribers on my channel, uh, that I would do another giveaway, which we did. And then I said, I would, you know, we'll do one outlandish gameplay and revamp and see if we can make them great again. Uh, and the chat chose <laughs> Titus O'Neill. And I was like, all right, y'all, y'all ponied up and and showered the bro with love so let's do it and that's what we did and i was actually quite surprised by it so we're going to continue that trend on the bros next stream hopefully the stream is going to be tomorrow night um I, there's no guarantee though i'm not sure it's going to happen so let's see rick rude gameplay yeah big love that was great <laughs> i really enjoyed that <laughs> so yeah I, I you know i agree with you dominic we are going to get we are probably going to get Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles at least once, maybe twice before their, um, before their uh, licensing runs out. But when, I have no idea, right? That's exactly it. So, Flare. <laughs> I mean, B10, Flare could be the next one. Uh, generate three multiplies will increase by three submissions. Okay. All right. Well, I don't think you have either of those things. So, choose a two by four into row breaks. Choose seven to destroy. Six to make into green. With TMNT, choose six to make into red. Three purples to modify into column breaks. Yikes. Uh, 
They'd have to come up with new TMNT, though, to be if that's the problem, if they wanted to do, like, an MLC for it. Now waiting on two plates you've won on streams. Two plates? Which one? Which two have you won, then, Curran? That's true, Bam Bam. Yeah, it was asked. There was nothing about it not being there. Uh, Splinter in April. Yeah, there's two, there's two more that can be brought in, right? Rocksteady, Bebop. Yeah. No idea, Clado. All that decision making is above my head. Yeah, the the Titus su it surprised the heck out of me. So it surprised everybody apparently. Six to make into green wouldn't help us. Make into red would help us, and then we can choose purple to destroy. Okay, all right. Yeah, you can put Splinter in there. There's I'm like I'm sure there's more that they can do. It's just a question of. How much do they have license to do? All right, what are our, what are our plates with this? Let's put on gem damage. Yeah, so Bebop, Rocksteady, they got lots they can do with it. Crank, yeah, they, they they got lots they can do with it. They just have to have the will to do it. And Vanilla Ice, that's right, they, we need the Ninja Wrap in there. Ninja, ninja, rap. Go ninja, go ninja, go. Go ninja, go ninja, go. Do, 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 do. Put both these on here. Derek, how you doing? Okay, so we have... Why do we only have 20%? Who's messing around with this? Who, dare I ask, is playing around with these sort of things? Put some Furies on there. Boo -doo -boo, boop, boop, there we go. <laughs> and you needed to give a talk to the Daviest of D's. Make sure you get yours. Make sure you get yours, sir. Baxter Stockman. Lots of lots of options out there, y'all. What are you? You are just a regular Fury in use. Fury twos. Okay. What are our things with this one? It's just row breaks do three hundred percent, and green submission moves do six hundred percent. All right. So we got the row breaks. Two by four, we'll make another two by four. All right. So we need move charges. Two, uh, six to make into red. Okay, so we need purple. Uh, purple, purple. Where is purple? Someone take all of the belts off the people that I'm using. We have to have a talk with these other content creators. Uh, gem damage. Row break gems do 200% more damage. There you go. Not sure that's gonna help everything, but there we go. We'll put all the row break damage on and see what comes of all of this. No, <laughs> money green ranger. Yeah, Texan. There you go. It sounds like a DJ thing <laughs> to do. Look at this. Blame it on DJ. Blame it on DJ. All right, let's let me see what this does. Since we're trying, uh, I didn't catch that. If I take advantage of off in the flash market, does that count towards the web coin spend event? I honestly don't know, Derek, to be quite honest. Can someone answer Derek's question? Are you required to buy from the web coin shop? The web coin spend event? I don't think so. 
I don't think it does, but I could be wrong. All right. Two by four into row breaks. It does count towards it. Thank you, Xerxes. All right. This wouldn't be four. This would be one. So we would have to make a five match. No, we don't want a five match on that, do we? In a regular place, we would need five. Come into red gems. That's fine. Let's just see what this does. And then we could put a second one here, like so. Choose seven purple to destroy. How many do we need? We need eight. So there's no way we could get that loaded up again to get that done. Okay. Mm, there's one, two. And that'll drop everything down. Otherwise, we'd be in bad shape. It's fun. Big destruction. Black gems. Was that 22 million? It was 22 million. There you go. 22 million at six gold. <laughs> There you go. We did it, everybody. Choose seven purples to destroy. Yeah, it's honestly not bad. I mean, like, it's not... It's, just, it's still just like a tickle in this case. Um, six gold. So you were, you were... You generate 22 black gems whenever you break seven or more. Whenever you make six or more, it's 50% for one turn. Okay. He's hitting low Zoro numbers. He's just hitting low numbers in general. Okay, so now, since we've already got that maxed out, we need a three match. And then we need to do something similar, turning as many of these reds as possible without blowing up the board. Okay. Nope. Didn't want to blow up the board, but that's okay. One, two, three. Totally messed it up. Actually, no, I didn't. We're good. Because we can still put that there. You just need a four match to blow all that up. There you go, bro. We got it. 22 black gems. And that did 18 million. Okay, that's not bad. Okay, so we're going we're gonna to change some trainers and stuff. Zombie chill. Nice, Tiger King. Yeah, yeah, we, we got this. We got this. We're actually going to make some black gem damage. All the extra row break damage isn't really helping us. We're only making, uh, what are we making? We're making 14 of the row breaks. So not, none of them are really buffed because of this. So let's manage. Let's go in the other direction. What's next? For, uh, yeah, I'm not sure what's next. All right. So black gems. Let's do some black gems. Black gems. Cool. Let's see if this works better for us. <laughs> I'm not sure I'm going to make him special, but I mean, if you can... Again, if you're going up against a 6 silver and he does, what, 11, 12, 13 million, you'll take out another 6 silver. Pyre the next. Yeah, they'll, they'll just keep going back and forth with it, right? All right, so I've I've got the gameplay now. I understand what we got to do. All right, so the first time through, we got to make a five match. All right, so we got to make a five match, and then we got to make a line break somewhere in there. Right, that's the other the other kicker. As long as we don't make a match anywhere. Wonderful, and then you can hit this a second time, like so. Black gems are doing 148k, which ain't a lot. Uh, we could actually... I need to put that inside, which I did not. That did not work as well as I wanted it to. Still blows up the board. What's that, 17 million? Down to 15? Uh, maybe the rule break gems is the way. What do you know? Nine to make it okay. So we need to choose. We have four, so we need to destroy four purple. 
yeah, Jesse J. I, I said it at the very beginning. Um, I put. And I'll, I'll read that blog again in a little bit. But yeah, there there is some news on that. Uh, we can actually put that there, right like that. We need a three match here, and then we could put uh, we could put red gems around the board if it matters. And then blow it all up. See if that makes a difference. Maybe black gems just isn't enough. Yo, Kid Kelly. And that does 18 million. Okay. So maybe maybe the row break gems was the way to go. Maybe they did maybe they did that much more damage that even with the black gem damage wasn't enough to overcome the the differences within it. Alright, well let's 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 switch it back. We'll run it again. Uh, but, 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 but the first time was 23 mil. So we will run it with row break gem damage. What's our other move here? Choose six to make it a green. Yeah, overall not so good because that's not gonna help us at all. See the the problem being is that this plate is a basic plate. If this plate was an ultimate plate where we got fifty percent for one turn whenever we made six then we could put the other plate in where you break red, get break purple, get red, um, or break red, get purple, and reload your stuff and, and try to get it off multiple times. So, uh, I don't know, Mukau. You'll have to ask Gopla. Make it sound like I know the answer to that one. Um, I mean, I might as well show it off. Might as well. We'll make videos of these things. Class is in session and the professor is in. We are on the Candy Store account. We got Rick Rude Hall of Fame. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> uh, who? Rick Rude Hall of Fame, six star gold. And you know what? Bro's on a mission. We made Titus O'Neill's somewhat better. <clears throat> so let's make this one better too. <clears throat> Excuse me. Ooh. Pause recording. Hmm. Better. There we go. I'm trying not to die. I'm, no, I got I got water. I just had some. I am good. I am good. I'm gonna continue the recording. So what are we doing with this guy? Well, we got two new plates in the game, so we're gonna throw both plates on the insatiable hunger. Whenever we make six or more row breaks, increase all your gem damage by fifty percent for one turn, and we'll put on down the rabbit hole the ultimate plate. Whenever we break seven or more row break gems, generate twenty-two black gems, hundred percent gem damage trap, fury two metals. We're trying to go for maximum damage on an old poster, so. Row break gems do 300% more damage, and that's what really what we're going for. So one gear is all you need on him, entourage-wise. You're going to need double purple MP to get this going on turn one. And then we're going to add all the row break damage we can, since row breaks is what's getting buffed right now. So that does include a couple of rare superstars. I get it. Yellow's also kind of rare. Cool. Welcome to, we're taking a bad card out on the road, so we need all the help that we are going to get. So let's take Rick Rude on the road. Let's bro. See if we can make him better. So in a feud, this would only have two move charge this is a one mp so it's going to go so we are going to do the ddt we're going to hit the two by four i realized i didn't tell everybody the moves that we were doing but that's okay we are going to put these down on red gems wherever we find them on the board to make it easier for ourselves we are then going to use a spike pile driver and we're going to choose nine into red 
we would need to make a five match somewhere of red gems. We'll just make a six match here and hope for the best. Uh, and then we need to make a line break with the rest of these red gems, and that's about it. We don't get the cascade. Now we're going to hit this a second time, so that is going to get the insatiable hunger plate to go off two times. We've now made a row break that's going to blow up all of the row break gems. So let's bro. Rabbit hole plate goes off, 22 black gems on the board. We get a decent cascade, and that did 20 million down to 18 and a half million. Will it take out every six star gold? Absolutely not. But it should take them out by the end of turn two, so might as well do that while we're here, while we're having fun. Now that everything's loaded up again, uh, we actually don't need to do too much with this right now. We actually just need a three match of red nope we actually have to make a four match somewhere a line break boom put this down a second time and we blow up the board so it really does depend on how the black gems and the cascade from that hits afterwards but you do blow up the board and if you get a good enough cascade that's a much better cascade than the last time and that did 19 million 19 and a half so there you go 20 million a shot is he going to kick out again absolutely he will because this is again Rick Rude Hall of Fame. You get the idea. <laughs> it's not the greatest, but it is a rework of some sort. It's the best the bro can do at this moment with him. But we'll try it on other people because our mission is not finished here. Thanks for coming to class. Professor out. There we go. All right, well, you, you get the idea. I mean, it's it's something. It's gameplay. Well, I probably could have done my turn. <laughs> we're we're going to let him sub us. <laughs> bro. We could have done so much more than that. Uh, let's quit this match. <laughs> Thanks for making the video for funsies. We'll see what we do with it. Back to the map. Scopey's going to nerf him. <laughs> By Blackstone. Did not hear about that. Did not kill Kelly. Definitely will not make you nerf him. All right, who else does row breaks that we want to see this on? Anybody else, or should we go to CSS for the weekend? What's our agenda on here? Uh, can I actually go to... Is it up here? Yes, that would be the place. That would be the place to go. Anything else? Marker. All right, I've put a marker down. No one can be upset about that. Cool. There we go. You want to see No other row break people you want to see? Who else does row breaks? Who else? Did, who did Merrick's not get to last night that does row breaks? I was at Epcot. I did not get to see it. If I remember, yes. I will do my best. I will try my best. I got you. Got it. Strowman? We are... Oh, let's, let's spell things. Strowman. Like, not that one. But that one? He did this Roman, 17 million at best. Okay. Anybody else we didn't do? We could go Shayna Baszler. Do we need some Baszler gameplay? Since she is CSS. The Bays. The bees and the bees. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> Jay Uso? I mean, we could do Jay Uso. I mean, we can do Uso. Uso. What's up, Bluesky? Jay? Like this Uso? Or that Uso? Mo 
Alt as a rope breaks. Uh, did Merrick's do Gacy last night? I mean, let's, let's throw it around and see what we get to. Row breaks. Six green gems to modify into row breaks. Boo. <laughs> Southside, that is a that is an amazing emote. Love it. Is there anything else you do? You just gotta hope it hits something then. Yeah, so this chooses six to make into Random, choose five and it multiplies. Yeah, it, there'd be no way to get that to go off twice, right? Yeah, so it's not going to work well on him. Especially since he does so much better with other stuff. What about other? Uso. Stizzle. <laughs> you is late. He did Peter Maya Via. Okay. It's got to work on somebody. Multiply blue tag, multiply. You were all multiplied. J. Oh my goodness. Powerhouse, Big Show, and Big John Stud have row breaks. Did he do the Skull King? I don't know. What about Scott Hall with the one MP? <laughs> Yes, Mule, uh, that was on as I was leaving Canada, the, the Mr. D show. Such a great show. All right, so we got we got Big Show. Let's see what we can do with them. Someone's got to be amazing with this. Big John Stud, maybe Scott Hall. Well... It's a great show. Is it still on? Is it still, is it still going? Three gems to make into row breaks. Increase your red MP. By six. This is a ten charge, though. Yikes. You won't, you won't get that to go off twice. Yeah, so that's, that's a no-go. That's way too high. All right, let's see if Big John... Big John. Big John. Big Bad John. Al Pacino. How you doing? Ron Simmons. Yes, Bearded. Random into row. Random blue into red. 15 finisher. Gah. You're doing good, nice. Ron Simmons might be the one. She's a four by two to destroy. Three random into blast. Four random into blast. Yeah, it's that's so high. I'm not sure we could actually get to the number that we need. Uh, hello to Bob. There was there is flash viewed uh, information. Hold on, he has a hold on. He has one of these moments right here. Purple moves, gems, multiplies, matching. Cherry five more. Farouk, Farouk, Farouk is on fire. <laughs> I, I thank you, Sue Pedri. Just it, it brings me back. 
to playing the game with my brother when we were kids. That's too funny. Um, is that, um, uh, let's see. Where is he on this? Yes, to Bob. That is all we had this evening. Purples into blacks. 13 random into row breaks. Okay, so what do they do? Purples random. Six random black into row breaks. Yeah, even this one's not, not that good. I mean, you could, could equip that. Good night, good night, Doctor Mr. Professor. Blue Blood Hunter. Eh, how many do we have to make though? We have to make six and destroy seven. Is it time again to bring the Connecticut? Cody Jones? I mean, is there a Cody Jones build that we would actually use it for? <laughs> well, Cody Jones is in general so good. Yes, I agree. As someone who made the video on him, he does. Center row into row break gems, yes. Two by four into purple gems. Swap a three by two into purple gems. One by three. SCV, SCTV and Red and Red Green are both classic Canadian comedy shows, but I mean like the Mr. D show is absolutely hilarious. He is so funny. So if we went Kids in the Hall was a great show. Great show, great show. All right, so we would need a yellow, right? To get one of those started, we would need a purple. Or do we go, we just go gem damage. You would only get that off one time, though, instead of two. I'm not sure we could get this off twice with using those two plates. Yellow. So this is a chance to make black gems. And black gems. And black gems, okay. I did not. Did Merrick's try it on Joe Gacy last night or no? Nice, Tiger King. Let's put that over there. Let's see what this hits for. He did try it on him? Okay, so that's probably like the best person to put it on, I would assume, would be to put this off on Joe, Joe Gacy. So, that answers the question, Brother Ray. I'm not sure if you made a video on it. Row break into column break. Okay, so we need two by two. We just need one match, correct? One match should do it. Okay. Make seven. It only makes one random. Okay, so this is this is the issue. You have to hope that it lands on something that there's a match with. Or else you in trouble. And that did six million. Boo this man off the stage. <laughs> Kim's Convenience Mule is one of the funniest shows. God, I love Kim's Convenience. That's so good. Uh, Albacino... I like 
Casey Jones the best because he just needs the least. But both LA Bite and ZM Punk are both so good too. At best, yeah. <laughs> I want to call them preparation age. Yeah, that was that was awful. All right, so. Huskus. Yeah, it's starting to feel that way. I'm just road breaks just haven't been a priority for anybody. So is the road breaks on here already? Two seven. So we don't need that. I mean, that would probably be what you would have to do. Your grandparents remind you of Mr. and Mrs. Kim? <laughs> Corner Gas. Corner Gas is another great Canadian show. Hell yeah. Multiplies. Let's make more of those. And then let's just put on Multiply Strength. Multiplies, multiplies, multiplies. Sure, why not? Let's see what this looks for. Confirm. Was that a gas station? That, that's that's corner gas. Kurgan, that's that's the one that, the, that your friend showed you. Corner gas. All right, let's try this with Gacy. Why does what say only steal four black MP? Okay, so we don't need that. So 36 random into row breaks. And then this would be two seven to make into yellow, which we wouldn't need. Trailer park boys. There we go. And then Do you get most? No, you get the most. I guess. Blow up the board. 22 black. Hey, there's 65 million on Gacy, so. <laughs> that is it. <laughs> that is actually it. <laughs> I mean... That ain't bad at all. All right, well, whatever. We'll make a video. We shall make the video. Bro coming out with video after video after video. Class is in session. The professor, <coughs> excuse me, is in. And we are going to re-record that introduction. Here we go. Class is in session. The professor is in. We got Joe Gacy, Huskus the Pig Boy, six star gold on the candy store account. Let's go uh, test out the new plates. We're doing it live on stream, so we might as well make a video while we're doing it. The insatiable hunger plate. Whenever we make six or more row breaks, increase all our gem damage by 50% for one turn. And then we'll add down the rabbit hole. Whenever we break seven or more row break gems, generate 22 random black gems. We're going for max damage, you know, 100% gem damage, Fury 2 medals, you know, the use that we do when we're on the candy store going for max damage. So driving clothesline is going to make a bunch of multiplies of strength 11 and then swap a 2x7 into red gems. We're going to make 36 random into row breaks. We're actually not even going to use the, the corner whip uh, at all at the moment. I don't see a reason to do so. Uh, so we're just going to run this line. We're only really going to use two moves. And since we got 99 MP, and since we're on the candy store and we're doing max damage, I don't care that these are rare characters, some of them. So multiply gems will increase the room strength by one, five more multiply gems, and then all the multiply strength that we can get. So let's, bro, we're going for max damage. This is what we do. This is what I do. So deal with it. I swear someone writes on my video 
to lose it. All right, so we're about 36 random gems into row break gems. That does 2 million, that move right there. And then we're going to hit the finisher. So two clicks. That was click one. Click number two is going to put all of the multiply 20s on the board. And then what we're going to do is we're going to try to hit a, the, the two columns that have at least a row break in each row. And this one has one in every single row. So that's a great one to go for. We blow up the board. We blow up all of the 20s. And then the plate throws 20 more black gems. That was a really poor cascade. And that did 58 million with just a couple of clicks. Uh, you can easily probably hit 70 million uh, if you were able to get a much better cascade of black gem damage on the end of that. You get the idea. So, I mean, 99 MP, that ain't bad at all. Anyways, let me know what you think in the comments. Thanks for coming to class. Professor out. Uh, do we actually want to see that with without 99 MP? Is that actually a thing? Uh, is that actually a thing? Could you run this post 99 MP? I mean, we could have made leech gems in the center. That actually probably would have done better too. We might have to do that again. Yeah, post 99 MP, you wouldn't be able to do this. Correct? You would have... You could increase your red MP. Yeah, this is just a 99 MP build. And so one by seven, we would be stealing 14 more million. Let's redo it. We're going to redo it. Let's redo it. All right, so we made a quick change. We put in the uh, middle move right here. We're going to put the 1x7 random area into leech gems uh, on the board. So we'll put the row breaks down first. Maybe we should put the leech gems down first. Whatever, we're going to do it anyways. We're going to steal close to 14 million if it hits all of them. And then we'll hit the finisher. And this should cover up a lot of the stuff on the board. It'll probably cover up some leech gems. This will break almost every row. That will break every row. So we're going to steal somewhere between 10 and 14 million in health, as well as do some damage. And that does not show us how much more damage that we did, but it was probably somewhere in the, if previous tests show it, in the kaboomy of uh, somewhere between 58 and 68 million and then you can add on whatever you steal for the leech so not bad at all so you're looking at probably 70 million all things considered maybe somewhere closer to the 80 million range not bad for a few clicks at 99 mp with all the bells and whistles because that's how we do it here in bro's classroom thanks for coming to class professor out i don't know i'll have to splice that one up Cut it up, put another marker down for the furbos. Okay, any other plate requests with this one? Anybody else that does row break gems in any fashion? Is it the Skull King? Or King Booker? Uh, is that the easier way to find them? Skull King. Or the, the evil Skull King. There's two Skull Kings. Remember when this guy was life? Hawk Bradshaw. Oh, he's got column break, so it's not him. Skull. Yeah, getting it off. Well, getting it off one might actually work. I mean, I don't know if it's better than what he already has. Can't 
six NMP and finish to choose three rows to destroy. My goodness. Yeah, you're right. There's no way you'd get anything off <laughs> more than one time. Just blowing up the board at this point. Top seven by two to purple. Start from the beginning, rewind. All right. Well, you'll be happy to know, Mike, that we got Hall of Fame Rick Rude to hit for $23 million at six-star gold. I know that's what you've been waiting for. Yeah, there's no way you can get that to go off two times. And then that brings in the logistics of... Wait, what's that? That one's six MP. You need a line bonus, too. Blech. <laughs> okay, <laughs> fast forward, fast forward, skip. Prepare to fast forward, preparing to fast forward. Fast forward, fast forwarding, sir. Uh, is it this one? Yeah, we're trying to find places for the new... <laughs> the new plates that just came in that no one seems to be happy about, so... Submission, it's not you, it's the other one, okay. All right, anybody else? Because if not, we go CSS. Pause. What the hell am I looking at? This is now, now. <laughs> Everything that's happening now is happening now. Go back to then. When? Now. Now? <laughs> you did. I'm saving that one, Lumberjack. <laughs> when will then be now? Soon. How soon? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you know what, too, Bob? I can I can appreciate that it has been. This has been a very expensive. You just missed it. When? Now. When will then be now? Soon. How soon? 36 randoms turn into snowfall black gems. Eight to make into subs. Uh, turn into immobiles. Okay. What's up, Commander? Just comb the desert. You hear me? Calm the desert. Yes, sir. So we need sub plates. Sub a dub dub, right? You are yellow and black gems. Uh, I did not play around with the dual katanas, I don't think. Hold on. Which ones is the dual katanas again? Is it in here? Well, somebody must have. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I played around with a lot of different builds for this one. It was a lot of fun. I don't think I actually made any videos of it, unfortunately. But I should. I mean, we can play. I, I did that on stream last week, though. Uh, Lion's Gaze will not help us. It will not help us. <laughs> a black sheriff. Worked at Blazing Saddles. Ha ha. <laughs> Sir, are we being too literal? No, you fool. We were told to cold in desert, so we're coming in the desert. <laughs> Found anything yet? Nothing yet, sir. <laughs> Nothing yet, sir. All right. I do need to do this one more time before we actually finish off for the night so i was going to go back here for just a quick second go back to the bliggity blog <clears throat> because we were going to do that's yellow move damage and starting green mp boo that's the plate you picked up on nice well whenever you get that one you shall be very happy sir that is a good plate to have kurgan it was very good 
Uh, all right, y'all. Flash feuds info. I've already read this one time. It's very simple. This is the one that's in game, so I'm not going to go over that. Flash feud number two. And then we'll come back to some exciting, tantalizing Shayna Baszler gameplay. Once I figure out if anyone is interested in joining. Oh, nice. Speaking of Canadian bands and things, my sister just messaged in the family group chat that they're going to see Blue Rodeo in Toronto, <laughs> December 28th. Worked in Blazing Saddles. All right, so that's feud number two. This is feud number three. Up, get all that information. There we go. For those that would like to take their... Yeah, there we go. Candy. For those that like to take their screenshots. And feud number four. I <laughs> think see Tom Cochran. I'm really sad that, you know, one of the few people that I didn't get to see, I was too young and he had passed away before I became in concert going sort of age, was Stompin' Tom Connors. I missed going to see Stompin' Tom, which is too bad. I did go, get to go see the Tragically Hip several times. So. All right, we good? Everyone's got it? Good. Few times, everyone's got it. <laughs> you are welcome to Bob. You sir are welcome. Previous, no, I guess we got nothing on here. Uh, okay, so we're looking at. I wanted to bring that up so I can see what I had to do. So if you're going to use her at six star, you will get plus one starting MP and fifty percent yellow move damage, which is going to do. Absolutely nothing for her yellow move that does 142k. Buh. All right. A couple ways to run her. Um, convert all traps into powers. Buh. You can do bonus for every snowfall if you wanted to, but that doesn't hit very hard either. Um, you can also do the kick out move. Yeah, I saw that, Kirk, and I saw that as a, as a possibility. Um, I mean, you can run her triple yellow. Um, I like this way because you just you, you get the subs going on over and over and over again, right? The sub doing 204k, this one doing 136. And snowfall damage. Yeah, you can do that as well, too. This this makes yellow, yellow moves, right? So... What I like about the 7x2 is that you get to destroy the snowfalls all over the board. I don't know, we can run it several ways. So we're going to have plus 1 MP. Yeah, so I got the baddest jacket on there. I got the other sub plate on there. Uh, and we would only need one yellow MP to get the one sub going. Uh, and that would be for three turns. Or we can do double black MP. But we want to go with one of the two. So if we went, so let's say we went yellow. And then you can just go move damage. So you can run black damage, like black, um, black gem damage. Or you can just go sub damage, like any seller commission move, you know, and just go sub Try to sub people out. Sub. And black sub. Sure, why not? We'll run that. Let's go.
the reason why I like it this way is that they would have to get, she would have to get a match for it to work. All right, so now we get a seven by two to destroy. It's gonna turn everything black below. So you can do something like that. And then you have the second sub. This is going to turn things into yellow. There's one, two, three. And then we can just put these anywhere else we feel like. So this is going to take forever, <laughs> but you get the idea. So if you, you can also buff the snowfall. I don't know. It's up to you. All right. We get the idea. This is going to take for absolute ever. But that's one way it's hard to lose. You're doing sub after sub after sub. But again, we are going into a feud where you want to be as fast as possible. Mr. Bungles, how you doing? So if we wanted to go in the other direction, then why don't we do that instead? Dina, what up? Snowfall. Those are snowfallers. Snowfalls. <laughs> What's up? B Rock's here, but Bro Rock is also in the building. Uh, she's a trainer? I thought she was a coach. Thank you for correcting me on that one. Oh, God. I'm trying to find her is going to be just impossible. Oh, gosh. She could be anywhere. She's actually in use. There she goes. We found her. Mm -hmm. Snowfalls. Anybody else do snowfalls? Uh, just, uh, besides the snoop, I don't think so. Where's the Miz plant? I 
The Miz plays red gems, though, isn't it? Don't matter. I can't find it. Maurice does 200%. That probably also is true. That sounds like it's true. Oh my god, let me get this match started. I were Maurice. There you go. Mm, there's a bug in the new Stip Tour. You don't have any enter, but you do have him. Did you try restarting? Did you try turning it off and turning it on again? Yeah, B10, I've been asking every month since I've been here. <laughs> every month I ask for that. Just it's just for time on streams, y'all. Yo. You tried that? Okay, that was actually just a joke, Mr. D. <laughs> like, have you tried turning it off and turning it on again? Uh, no, nah, just uh, if there are any of the mods in here, hopefully they will have caught some of that. So how much is this doing? 400k per... That did not bad. So there's 11 million. Now you got to find a match of your snowfalls or, or we don't reload. Yep, we don't reload. He gets or she gets. So no, okay. Yay, reload time. And now we can do this into yellow. So... One, two, three. There we go. Oh, King Leopold's Ghost is such a great story. Adam Hochschild is a fabulous story. Well, he's a journalist. But writes really well in terms of history books, too. He's written a couple of really good books, Platinum Patrick. So this might be faster if you can find matches that will load up your black moves again. There you go. There's, there's a way to run it. My goodness. Get those four matches done fast. Because they're going to be brutal. To roll through. All right. Well, there's tantalizing Shayna Baszler gameplay. <laughs> any other uh, any other recommendations? The Belligans, the Belligans, <laughs> or the Belgians. Either way. The Belligans. Uh, who else do we got that is CSS this weekend? Is, is Chelsea Green? Chelsea Green is CSS. No, you're not Chelsea Green. Ribblays. Do I have to actually go searching for? Da, 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 da. Entitled. She's having to make it into purple. Oh, 
Oh, this is all move damagey things. I remember how to play this game, I think. Previous, do we have anybody better? So we need blue. You can do purple finisher. You can do Santa Hogan. You can do Santa. You can do you. That would make it easier. If you wanted to write, because we get plus one. So for the plus one, our turn in Santa, that would be enough. And, okay, so you deserve, you deserve, you deserve. Like, what the hell? Who, who, who's doing this? Who's putting affiliation straps on non-MP people? I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose it. A double submission with the bleed? Why? Why, Bam Bam Fam? Why would you do that? Why would you do that? Recycle and bleed bonus. I mean, what's the what's the bleed bonus that we're getting? Is it worth? Is it worth? Bleed will cost three hundred percent more damage. Yeah, see, any anybody's bottom row is going to have a technician that you can use, right? So you're just going to go up against the technician. Is there a tech here that we can show this off against? Let's just show how easy this is. Who amongst you is a technician? You're not a technician. You're a technician, but I don't think we can actually go up against you, could we? Nope. Go against that one. You are not a technician. You are a technician. You are the weakest link. I mean, throw Santa Hogan on here. Okay, bottom line has a technician. So you are almost guaranteed to go up against a technician each and every time. So you're going to be able to hit the the second hardcore part of this. We're going to deal another, does that say, 6 million damage? And that's going to hit for 4.5 million damage. I don't even think I changed the strap properly. DJ Explosive, what up? So... It might not hurt. It might be a good idea, but even still. Uh, so this in feud is going to be, so we have plus one, our turn. So this is already going to be at two. So we would have to make two, three breaks, right? That would fill it up. Try to break as many of these trap gyms as we could. I don't know. We'll see if it, let's hope. So that worked. It would fill everything up, and then we would do 27 million and 35 million, and that is without a purple move damage medal. <laughs> That's just take down twos and a hundred percent. So there is your 62 million against any technician you go up against. 
Like that's, I mean, sure. Use the bleed, use the sub, but everyone's lineup has any technician on the bottom row, right? Like that's an easy guaranteed win to go up against that. Well, she she has plus one starting MP, right? So with Santa Hogan, I didn't put Santa Hogan in there, but I mean, like you can could have taken him out, but yeah. So Santa Hogan, that's one, and that's five plus one starting MP is six, and your turn is seven. The blue moves are ready to go. Easy. I mean, y'all do what you want to do. But y'all, y'all know Chelsea. Chelsea Greed. Uh, take down, not furious. Take down, bros. It it really is like it's, it's two three matches over trap gems and then you hit the finisher and it's done uh the moment does like purple gem damage and a whole bunch of other stuff it's actually not gonna none of it's gonna help with what we're gonna do with with this specific move set but i'll show it to you in a second all right so all the traps go down and now the finisher is doing eight million and ten million so again two three matches is all you need And that way you try to break you try to break six of the trap gems as best you can. That does 33, that does 43. There you go. There's there's your 76 million. Sub if you must. <laughs> Sub if you will. <laughs> but but that that seems like a really quick and painless way to run Chelsea Green for an entire feud. You're going up against technicians every time. That's just you just target their technicians and go. Feels like we need a video. Three purples. <laughs> I mean, you can do that too. Purple, purple, purple. Uh, seven random gems to uh, increase your purple MP. That seems easy enough. Moment. The moment does a bunch of less color damage from all gems. That's always helpful. Yeah, Pyro Botch will generate more trap gems. We just need three to hit. Pretty easy. Yes, to be if she is. Assuming you peasants have the place. <laughs> Class is in session and the professor is in. What's happening, y'all? We got Chelsea Green entitled. It seems like some of y'all might have to use her this weekend. We got her six gold. We're on the candy store account. Uh, we got everything uh, with it. So we do have the moment. The moment's really only going to help with the generating trap gems, whenever we generate a uh, move is gonna do 10 more. So uh, we'll show you how to run this. We'll do it with and without the plates. You get an idea of just how hard this actually hits. So do it once with the plate. So we're gonna go with takedown twos and we're gonna have 180%, <coughs> excuse me, move damage. We got the purple move damage on there as well too. And we got her plate, her ultimate plate. Whenever you make 15 or more traps, increase your purple move damage by 200%. The way you would run her is the double blue with the purple move at the end. And we're gonna go up against technicians. And since a technician will be in the bottom row of everyone's feud lineup this weekend, you'll have someone easy to target. So you only actually need one of uh, one MP trainer. So it's gonna make it better for you this time around. So because you get plus one starting MP and your turn. So you'll have seven with a Santa Hogan. So missing here is Santa Hogan, Santa Hogan, blue MP. And then 
it makes it easier and less cascade risky if you have yourself an NWO Hogan. If you don't, you just got to match more gems. So let's take her on the road against a technician. So you can see, let's bro. So we'll run this twice with and without. Um, and you can see whether you, you like it or not. It's just the easier way to run her quite personally. So uh, we are going to put down these random gems everywhere. Your goal now is to try to break as many trap gems as you can without cascading. So that way we can hit this finisher. The trap gems are going to increase our purple move damage. So right now we have an 8 million. And because we're going up against a technician, we got another 10 million right here. So we have just about 19 million when all is said and done. So we would just need two, three matches. And with the moment, it makes it easier. It puts more trap gems down, but it's not necessary. So without the cascade, now we're looking at a 33 and a 43. So we're looking at 76 million finisher. Done. And then it reloads all your blue moves, just like that. So that's why you would take it up against a technician, right? So that's one of the good things about using her in a feud in this build, in this lineup, is that against a technician, that hardcore move gets beefy. But what if you don't have the plate? Well, we'll try it without the plate so you can see if it's still sort of worth your time, if you can get away with some quick and easy wins with this move set. All right, so let's edit this. We'll go no plate. All right, let's bro. Let's see what we think. Two hundred percent is a lot, no doubt. But you can definitely try. And so this might be where you might want to try to break more of these. All right, so there's three traps right there. There's three traps right there. And hopefully nothing cascades. So now we're going to hit 25 and 32. So we're still going to hit 57 plus million. That's enough to take out most six star golds. So it's up to you. <laughs> if you have all those other pieces, then awesome. And if you don't, then there I'm sure are other ways to run her to take advantage of that. But that's how the bro runs her. So let me know what you think in the comments. Thanks for coming to class. Professor out. <laughs> Fight this five seconds. <laughs> I mean, like, even still, 50-something. <laughs> Fight those fives. Yeah, take out the trash on other people's lineups. The, 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 the sub and the bleed is fine. It's just going to take time, right? <laughs> Thought I was going to do Steiner math again. Kirk and I am always good for Steiner math. You know me, bro. Steiner math is what I do, man. Anyways, that's that's how I would run Chelsea. Quite honestly, quite quite intently this weekend. In the feud, just target other people's technicians. I don't see any reason why you wouldn't want to. So, uh, if I were going to mark that as red, and we are going to who's the other one? Oh, it's Roxanne. Bad boy DJ, how you doing? Uh, I do like Striker Rowan. <laughs> You're welcome, brother. Ray. <laughs> Make sure you watch the video. Make sure you like when the video comes out. I mean, I mean, like again, y'all do, y'all do, y'all do what you feel like. I'm not here to show anyone else how not to do it. The Prodigy. Do 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 do. Oh, almost forgot. We have to put markers down for the Furpo. Akil, how are you? Hello, hello. So if y'all have gotten this NXT arrival moment, uh, you will notice that we are going to get some multiply gem strength, yellow gem damage, which will help out 
Do, 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 do. Yay! Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. So someone's already done this. Y'all know the tricolor Musa, yeah? Yeah. Yellow blue. Yellow blue. Hold on. Oh, is this before? Boop, 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 boop. You have her played in a 50% mood damage trap? That, that'll do. We're doing, we're doing black. This would have been before. Before we had the new ones on here. Purple, blue, let's blast. Black and multis. Yes. Yes. What am I missing? Right? We need blue and the line bonus. Blue, yellow line bonus. No, yeah, the, the OTC Kurgan is is amazing. Is amazing. I definitely need a lane bonus to get those going. Modify into all black gems below. We would need a lane bonus. We'll change it up in just a second. Do, 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 do. Is there another worthwhile plate here or no? I don't remember. Elaine Bennis. <laughs> Elaine Bennis. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's not going to help us. I'm not just going to remove anything on that one. Okay, so we would need a lane bonus. That's going to do yellow move damage, which is going to help us. We have plus one starting MP, so we do have a lane bonus. So we would actually need Santa on here, correct? To get this going turn one. Is it Santa? Unless we put at the top row, which would be something else. It's been a while. Striker Strowman can make it. Well, we have a lane bonus this weekend to kill. That's why we're we're testing it out. All right, what do we have? So uh, with a lane with Elaine Bennis, uh, this would be at two. So we would need a six. Yes. Like that. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Close. Dough. Now you're in deep dough. Now we're not going to be able to blow up everything. <laughs> That's all I'm ever going to Now I can't say anything else but a lane business. So you all, you all can thank Jay Nasty for that one. 
Yeah, definitely not going to blow up as much as I wanted to that one. So that did 19 down to 16. She's going to kick out of this. And hit the sub. Bro made a mistake. Bro made a mistake. We can do better than that. Bro mess up. It happens. It happens to the best of us. For every Titus O'Neill, <laughs> there is a bro mistake somewhere. Uh, faction help will not help. Yeah, that's what I was trying to do. I was trying to save a, a match on top and I didn't get it. I did not do it. I cascaded and that wrecked my turn. Wrecked it. Do, 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 do. Okay. We try again. Yeah, you you have to, you want to do something like that and then do something like that, right? And then choose three columns. Like so. These are 13 doing 3.24. They're going to have plus four, plus five. What does the moment bring? It's not going to show the moment on here. But the moment's going to add more gem damage for that. Then you put the six by one. And then you blow up. Oh, I did. <laughs> bro, you're better than that. 51 million and the bro messed up again. Bro's got to do better. You don't need a four match. You need a three match, bro. Come on. So, yeah, I should have done go 60 million. Wrecked him. <laughs> Damn near killed him. <laughs> Damn near killed him. That's too funny. Yeah. Just need a three match on the top. Bro, be better. Yo, Eagles, how you doing? Three match on the top. That's all you needed. That's all you needed, bro. That was it. Don't cascade. There you go. Uh, then you can do something like this, bro, right? One, two, three. And then the one by six. And then we do something like that. That's better. There you go. There's your 70 million. And that's before all the moments and all the extra bonus you'll get for being a feud. So... There you go. The format was greedy. I was just being way too greedy. I wasn't paying attention enough. It's past the witching hour. It's almost 10 p.m. my time, y'all. I gotta go to bed. We ain't even making a video. Try color. Use it. Use it to your advantage. And use your Chelsea green to most effectiveness this weekend. All right, I think we're good. I think we're there. I think we're done, to be quite honest. Put another marker down. Let the Furpo do what he needs to do. Any other questions of things? Do I need to show this one more time? I mean, I might as well. Since we're already at this page, let's go there. Yeah, that tricolor moveset is amazing. Thank you, Mike, for showing it to me. Uh, feud number one, that's already in game. Y'all already know it. Feud number two, anybody who needs to take a screenshot can do so now. And feud number three, take your screenshots now. Yeah, because you got extra black gem damage and you have the moment as well, too. If you got that moment to kill, you're going to do so much more damage, right? So much more damage. And feud number four. Bro has done what he said he would do. 
And we are good. We are good. I did not have Hollywood in that setup. I just did a six match. Have a good night, y'all. This class be over. And we're going to look for places to raid. Is someone doing WWE Champions? Is it just me? Okay, it's just me. Cool. All right, well, that makes it easy. Have a good night, y'all. Thanks for coming to class. I'll see y'all later this week. Professor, out.